Hello guys and welcome to Stevie C TV. It is the Manchester Derby. Um, I'm sat here waiting to go in, um, walking across to the stadium. I am excited for this one, I'm not going to lie. Uh, the sun's out, everything's out. I am hopeful for this game. I am excited. This is my first derby. Let's see what we can do guys. You're going to follow me and we're going to have a right good day today. And um, you're going to enjoy what I enjoy. Let's bring the derby on. Come on, United! You alright guys? Just seen the lineup. We have got Johnny Evans, Maguire and McTominay in the squad. I'm worried now, starting to worry. Um, not sure what I think of that lineup. I'm not happy with it. Uh, City look like they've got a strong side. Their middle four Alvarez, Grealish, Bernardo, Foden. Their ball control is going to be unreal. And with our defence with Evans and Maguire, I'm not sure. But come follow me, guys, and we'll uh, get into the game and let's see what happens. Near the gate, start of the game. Wait, players have just gone back into the tunnel. Um, I'm still going with a draw, but let's see what happens, guys. Not sure what's going on to be honest. See, I've been warning a penalty. Not too sure what's going on to be honest. Um, don't know why it's been given, but they've been given the penalty. Uh, let's see what happens. I'm not happy with that. I can't even see any challenge or anything. Obviously, you can hear it now, fans are booing already, so let's see what happens. Man City penalty, Ireland. Come on, United, you need to turn it around. We know what we are, you cheating bastards. We know what you are. Oh, look at Keep going, keep going. Oh. Ireland, chance there for Hoyland. Unlucky not to finish. Get it back across and absolutely went over. Unlucky, unlucky, come on. Come on, United! Oh, why are you playing it short? And now I know we've got an amazing save from Har Har um, Harlan's header. Um, wow, wow. Should have been 2 0 for City there. What a save, what a save. You alright guys, half time, 1-0. Um, not sure what to think of that half. About 60% possession for uh, City. They're just not good enough, we're prattling about at the back. Uh, Maguire and Anana need to communicate a lot better. Then we've got, I believe the penalty was down to Hoyland holding on to Rodri. Um, a poor, poor decision, I think. Uh, but it is what it is. It's 1 0. Ireland's got the penalty. A few yellow cards in the half. I think uh, Amrabat needs to play safer. Uh, but we'll have to wait and see what happens in the second half. Uh, come on, United. We need to turn things around. And I think players like Nacho put a bit of life into United in this one. It looks like we dropped our heads after the goal. So let's see. Let's see what happens. Come on, United. 
literally just seen the VAR uh, decision. Rodri's already on the way down to the ground there. Hoyland has not done anything. Yeah, his arm might be there, but he's not pulled him down at all. Rodri was already running in and his body was already falling over before he touched him. Looks like Mount's warming up um, at half time. I reckon Amrabat will come off in the uh, half time, second half. And um, I think he'll uh, look into the yellow card there and not risk it. So let's see what Tenag does. Early corner for United. Can we make something of it? Take our chances. That'll be a no. Close one, no. Close one. Manchester City 2 0. Not even five minutes into the second half. Haaland with a goal header. Open three at the back. Poor defending that. Poor defending. Looks like it's game over so far at the moment. Come on, United. Grealish just had a chance then. Uh, a nine to save. Grealish has left way too much space. Should be closing down a lot better. United's passing has been off this game. Come on. 15 minutes of the second half. They're just having way too much of the ball, passing the ball around us. Uh, it looks like Amrabat's are missing in this game now. He's, uh, that substitution with Mount, Mount's done nothing so far. So let's see what happens, but it's not looking good for us United fans. Just not good enough this. We've got nothing up front. We've got nothing. Every ball coming across, getting to their defenders every time. Just no attack with us at all. Uh, nobody moving. Just not enjoyable to watch this. Not enjoyable. Another corner. Marcus Rashford with a chance there. He's very unlucky. Great position. Great ball over from uh, I think it was Gallo. Unlucky there. Unlucky. Just passing it around us now. Passing it around us. City corner. Anana with a great save there. Anana's just stopped Harlem from getting his it. I think it's time for some subs from uh, Ten Hag now. He needs to change up the game. City are getting way too much of the ball. Need to uh, make those subs soon. Oh, it looks like he, someone might be coming on now. Ganacho. Looks like Ganacho. So let's hope he brings a bit of life into the squad. Ganacho on for Hoyland and Lindelof off for Regulon. Just had a boo around the crowd then for the uh, substitution taking Hoyland off. Man City 3 0. Uh, don't know who scored that one, but it's tapping across. Haaland assist. Nowhere to be seen today, United. Just not good enough. Fans are already starting to leave. It's not good. 10 minutes left, 3 0. Rashford off for Martial. Eriksen off for Anthony. Five minutes left, Five the substitutions, but Rashford getting cheered off, that says everything about this game. City free kick, looks like the last kick of the game. Um, what can I say? Be glad when it's over. Full time, 3 0 Manchester City. What can I say? What can I say? Not good enough. Not good enough at all. Pass around us the whole of that second half. Second half is shocking. So I don't think Rashford even touched the ball all game. Just don't know what to say about it. Let me get back to my car and I'll uh, give you a little bit of a recap of what's happened. Right, back in the car, soaked through, absolutely pissed it down. But, let's talk about the game. Uh, the only good thing about that game was Anana, and he conceded three goals for United. What are we playing at? I do not know. Literally, everything in that game, shocking. Absolutely shocking. I'm lost for words for even to talk about like how bad we were. I don't necessarily think it was how good City were they kept the ball as we thought it would be but they just couldn't get the ball and when we did get the ball the pass, the basic passing we just not got it 
we're passing the ball straight back to him. Every cross that we put in, straight back to the defender, straight back to the keeper's hands. What the fuck are we playing at? I do not know. I, I genuinely think Ten Hag's in trouble now. I genuinely think, because of the players, Ten Hag is in trouble. Um, is it because we're missing all our defenders in as uh, injuries? Uh, we've got Shaw out, we've got Wamba Saka out. Looked like he wanted to go with those two at the beginning of the season. Obviously, we're playing Maguire and Johnny Evans at the back as well. So, we've got Varane sitting on a bench. You've got it all wrong today, Tanag, And it's going to put you under pressure. It is definitely going to put you under some pressure. But, we have to take it. We have to um, move on. But, we can't keep playing like this. We can't keep passing it around near the back. And there's a few mistakes today where we just... We had Anana and Maguire nearly running to each other. Just not talking to each other. Maguire ended up doing it with somebody else. And the worst bit is, is that Maguire's had a good three games before this. And his confidence is just going to drop right off now. Drop right off. And he's going to get dropped for Varane. And uh, Martinez when he comes back. So, where does that put Maguire? Um, Rashford, where were you? Rashford was absolutely shocking today. I don't think he got many touches of the ball. And when he did, he got the chance, he got time to um, think about what he was doing. And he'd rush straight into it and get it all wrong. It's just not good enough. And I think we dropped Anthony this game. And I think Rashford needs to start getting dropped. He got booed off today. He got booed off the pitch. We we booed Ten Hag when he subbed Hoyland off for making the wrong sub. And then we go and get Rashford... I've never liked him. I'm not going to lie. I've never liked him. Last season, we all cheered for him. And you know why? Because he put the ball in the back of the net. The guy can't even score 10 goals a season. He had one season that he's done that. One season. What can... It's just not good enough at all. We want a striker that can score 20, 30 goals. Hoyland can't even do it in the Premier League at the minute. And I'm, we're, buzzing, we're buzzing off him. Nobody can do anything up front. It's just not good enough. And I think the first person who's going to take the cut is going to be Ten Hag. And it's coming soon if we don't pick up these results. Because I think he saved himself with the last couple. Um, we were quite lucky. Yeah, I'm starting to think I'm a bit of a hoodoo. I've won <laughs> two games, no, three games that I've been to here this season where we've won. Every other game, and we've lost every single one. I'm spending 40 to £60 pound per game. If not, a tiny little bit more. To watch this shit. What are we doing? I want to come to games and enjoy the fact that I'm a Man United fan. But I can't. Every game, I'm getting pissed off. And looking at every single player and thinking, move, move, move. We're stood like freaking statues, man. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what the answer is either. It's come from the top, yes. It's come from the top. Yeah, Glazers should be gone. But, Tenag, you need to change things up. And you need to change them fast, otherwise your job's out. And the players, every single one of you could be sold this season. Because you're just not good enough. Every single one of you. Yeah, we went into that game thinking we're going to lose. But, I was optimistic. It started off as a sunny day. And now, it's a wet, miserable, and wasteful day. I feel like I've wasted my day watching that. I was excited to come my first derby, but United, once again, they've ruined it. Thanks for watching, guys. Sorry I couldn't give you a win there, but like the video, please subscribe, and I'm out. Goodbye.